Okay, I apologize for this going into a second video, but it is what it is. Um, but I want to show you guys how I started this off. Um, I took hot glue and I put it up here at the rim. After I cut what I needed, I cut it. I counted the rolls. It's 27 rolls down, and uh, I folded in half, so I got all my rolls are the same size. And the reason why I did this is because it won't lay right if you um, try to put this whole row on it, it's going to buckle. So this is why I did this, so that I can lay these side by side. So I can lay these side by side and uh, and I'll be honest with you, um, it will overlap a little bit, but not so much that it's going to look bad. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, finish this out. I just want y'all to see how I put it. Remember, I overlap. I put this side by side. Put the glue. Made me a bead of glue right here. Took a bead of glue right here. Laid this on top of it. Put it side by side. And it's going to overlap at the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and put this second piece on here. Like I said, on a one woman show. So I'm going to have to put you on pause so I can do this. All right? Hold on. Okay. I put the second row on. And uh, if you look at it good, you'll see at the bottom it overlaps. But that's okay. And, it, and you're going to have to do this all the way around. But when... You finish with it and look at it, you're going to see that you really like it. And I'm going to show you a technique I use to cover the overlapping where you can't tell that it was overlapping, okay? So, I'm going to go ahead and complete this and show you guys uh, what it looked like at the end, all right? Okay, so it's going to be puckering up a little bit around here and you're going to see this. So it's not going to have that smooth look to it, right? So I'm going to show you how to get that smooth look. Um, I took strips of the bling wraps and I cut two, two rows. And I'm going to put these on top of everywhere um, it overlaps. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And uh, I'm going to come back and show you what that looks like. Okay, I've done the whole thing, you know. I'm actually uh, adding the strips on. I'm taking this extra glue off right now. Um, as you can see, you can't tell where it's overlapping anymore. And uh, you see right here where it's overlapping? See that overlapping? And that's overlapping. Uh, what I did was I cut some strips like this, two little strips, and I put them where they'll go up and down and look like uh, another row. So it covers the overlapping, uh, and plus it give it a, a whole nother look, really a very expensive look. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, tap this on. I put glue at the top here. Excuse me, y'all. But I put glue at the top here and a bead, a real light bead all the way down. You see how this is opening up? So I'm going to cover all that up where that won't show no more, all the way down to the bottom. All right? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and finish this off and show you what this looks like. I'm still not through, so hold on. Okay, and now for the um, tongues, um, I covered them differently. I cut four strands of the bling wrap. And where it's rounded off at the end, I put glue here all the way from one side to the other side. And I took the bling wrap and I just held it so that it would mimic the shape of the tongs. Now you can do the tongs all silver like this one or you can bling them out like I'm about to do. Okay? 
So I'm going to go ahead and do this. And then I'm going to show you what it looks like when I'm through with it. Okay.